Hi there, uh, this is Troy from Green Dragon, and I uh, wanted to show you how to boot um, into another device like a DVD drive on an HP Pavilion 20. This is going to be true for uh, many computers that have Windows 8 or 10. Uh, sometimes there are security features that disable booting from other devices. Um, I'm going to show you how to turn that off. So first of all, I turn the computer on. I start hitting the escape key to get to this startup menu here. And so I want to go to the boot menu, which is F9, or I can just toggle down. And I want to boot from the DVD drive. And it will fail. There's a secure boot violation. It's not going to let me boot into this for security reasons. So what I need to do is turn it off, turn it back on, Start hitting the escape key again. Tap, tap, tap. Waiting on it. Okay, so what I need to do instead is I need to go down to the, uh, let's see, computer setup F10. There we go. Get into the BIOS, the basic input output system. So I'm going to head over here to security and uh, secure boot configuration. And it's giving me this warning about changing the settings. I'm just going to hit F10 to accept it. Okay. Legacy support disabled. I really want to enable that. And so I'm going to hit the arrow key to the right. Oh, we get an error here. This is secure boot option may only be enabled if the legacy support option is disabled. Okay, so I hit enter. So what I need to go down here is uh, is move down to secure boot, and then move it to the right. That'll disable it. Let me go back up to legacy support, move it to the right, enabled. Great. Hit F10 to accept. Okay, and now we just need to get out of here. Let's see. I'm going to go back to file, and then the last one here, save changes and exit. And of course, I can always get back in here and change the change this whenever I get done. And are you sure? Yes. Enter. So now, if I hit Escape, it should allow me to boot into the DVD. So this customer has a bad hard drive, and I want to clone it. Okay, so. It's going to ask me this, the operating system boot menu uh, mode changed. I have to type in 1702 plus enter. Now this, this will probably be different every time, so yours may be different, but it'll, it'll tell you right there what to type in. 1702, enter. Okay, and now I'm going to go to the uh, boot menu and select the DVD drive. thinking about it there we go great that worked okay thanks take care